Man, yo, YouTube, what's good, what's good, what's good? It's your boy DSKiss147 back in another vid. Um, been a while since I've been on YouTube, and uh, I know a lot is going on in the world, the whole quarantine time. So, a lot of YouTubers are doing this, sneaky YouTubers are doing this. It's showing their, you know, most of their collection. I want to show you my top, I don't know, eight 2020 pickups so far this year, probably nine. Uh, let's get through this. So, coming up first, a Yeezy. Um, these shoes, these shoes are actually for sale. So they're not my size, but it still has to be on the list of a 2020 pickup. Oh my god, I got one hand. He's my phone. Hold on. It is. The Yeezy Earth, size 11. If anybody want, it's for sale. It's not my size, I'm a size 10. But yeah, size 11, Yeezy Earth is on the countdown. All right, let's close that up. All right, next on the list, we have the UNC Jordan 3s. Size 10, um, not too sure if I want to keep these yet. Probably be up for sale too as well. Be on the lookout for these. The UNC 3s. Oh man, I love that smell. That's another pickup I got. Um, the Yeezys, I actually won those in the, um, in the um, Flex app raffle. And as you know, the story is supposed to get it for someone. The person kind of slack, but it is what it is. And then these, I just walked in. I just seen it. I'm like, oh, shoot. Let me just get two pairs of these. So that's how I got the UNC 3s. Uh, for action. Please send them all if you're from Queens. All right. Just walked in. Took a little line. I like, screw it. Got on it. Those things are pretty limited. All right. Let's see what's next on my list. What we got behind me? No, 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 no. This came out a few years ago. A few years ago. Last year, last year. Oh. For Valentine's Days. The UNC to Chicago. Bread, toe, whatever you want to call these things. These ones. Smell good, still brand new. Death stock, as you guys can see. Uh, 11 and a half. This shoe right here was a little hard to get, but like, the reason why I say it was a little hard to get because I couldn't get my size. Cause it's, uh, I'm a size 11 and a half, right? And women, that means it's a size 10. So you guys know the story. Bigger size, go for more money. And now you see the market kind of crashing, so I ain't go for much. But yeah, I got these bad boys uh, in a size nine in women. So I had to do a size swap, trade, whatever, to get my size, and got my size. Um, I had to get the leftover pairs. Like I said, this was kind of hard to get, but waiting for the line for the leftover pairs wasn't that bad. All right, let's see what's next. Oh, so these Jordans right here, last time I wore these. Whoa, it's kind of dirty. Yeah, a little dirty. I'm gonna clean my shoes. The last time I wore these, these are the white cement threes, right? Pretty kind of used. I got them for my boy. Um, this is actually my second pair of the 88 cement threes. My first time ever owning a pair. I got them was at SneakerCon, and then I ended up selling them at SneakerCon 2016, the last SneakerCon I went to, because I was out of the sneaker game, and then I was like, shit, I want to get back into it. So, got these for my boy for a good price. Um, yeah. Last time these guys came out was 2018 with the Nike check. Didn't like it. The Tinker one, right? And then the the blue one with the sole, missile. Didn't care for those, so I wanted these. But the only thing about these is that it have a Jordan on the bottom. It doesn't say Nike. Right? Unlike the black cement threes that says Nike on the bottom, right? I wear my shoes, well, most of them, but yeah. All right, oh, here's another one. A classic, 
the black cat fours. People who slept on these, man. And now these are sold out everywhere. The black cat fours are a classic shoe. Uh, I'll talk about it in my other video. What shoe number is that? That's one, two, three. Oh, there's number four on the list, right? Uh, and I'm not doing a countdown, going, going counting up, right? So, uh, yeah, the black cat fours is pretty cool, pretty decent, pretty dope. Never got these these bad boys in high school. Always wanted these things, and now I finally got a chance to own a pair of the black cat fours. Uh, when you we leave it in the drop box cases, the smell kind of go away. If you leave it in the box, the new smell is still there, so it kind of went away now. But I'm glad I got these. There's a pickup of 2020. And the core purple will definitely be on my list. On the nuts. Oh man, my favorite easy that I released so far this year, the Desert Sage. I remember I was saying that this shoe remind me of a Yeezy that came out from Nike Yeezy. I was saying that, I was saying the Yeezy too. Wrong. I was looking at Kais' video. Um, those of you guys know Kais is one of the biggest YouTuber out there. And he knew the, while, while I was thinking about the shoe, I was thinking about the, the Yeezy 1. It was like a grayish orange. So that's what this color reminded me of, of the Yeezy 1. Not the Yeezy 2, the Yeezy 1. But yeah, dope colorway, the best shoe. But best Yeezy to release this year by far. Uh, don't care about the cinders because I don't care for those. I don't need those. I got, got these. All right. All right. Um, I'm losing count here. That was one, two, three, four. That was number five. Um, anything down here is new? Nope. Those are all previous years stuff. Oh. Uh, I changed it up to my Yeezy right now. So, I always change this up. It was just the Jordan 1s not too long ago. Now, I put Yeezys up here. So, it's time to change it soon. All right. I got two pair of these, right? So, I caught this one back in December, right? Up there is somewhere is the second pair I caught earlier this year I'll say February when Snipes Kids did a uh, a grand opening so I caught another pair of Brother 11's so those are for sale size 10 hit me up if you want uh, but yeah we just want to put that on my list because I caught them in 2020 but these I caught them in 2019 so I just showing you these kind of feel like taking out those it's a lot of work over there there's a lot of boxes over there alright Next is the Concord 11s. Guys, if you remember my previous video, I'll tell you the story. I sold these to my boss. The reason why I sold them because I did not care for them because they had the 45 in the back. But these grew on me. Um, I remember how they grew on me. I was in a store somewhere. I was sitting down chilling and I seen this guy wearing them. And they remind me, I look like, oh, he got the 2000 Concords on. But the, the, the sole was yellow. But no, it was the 45 in the back. And I was like, yo, they look just like the 2000s. So that's the reason I got those. And the uh, reason I got these. And the 2011 that I hated, did the mesh get dirty really, really fast. But here, this one right here, it's like it's holding up. And the last shoe on the list is the Jordan Pine Green ones. All right. Pine Green ones, it's not getting that much love. Uh, I like it. That's why I got it. Um, definitely keep these. I like the material on these things. I just don't like the Wings logo. The red is unnecessary with the red laces, you know. But hey, I mean, it is what it is. So that's my list. Um, I will definitely be making more videos, uh, something like this. If you guys like, comment down below, uh, something different. Uh, yeah, so. Maybe the next video I'll make is my Jordan 1 collection. It's not crazy as everybody else's Jordan 1 collection. Um, if you look on my IG, like you see I used to have like a crazy Jordan 1 collection back in the day. Uh, but nothing exclusive. No Union 1s. No Travis Scott 1s. I'm not blowing money like that on those type of Jordan 1s. I'm not spending $1,000 on those things. Especially what's going on right now. But... Um, Speaking of which, he had the core purple ones. I'm definitely checking my hands on the blue toe ones. Uh, definitely those. Fire at fives. We all know why they're getting pushed back. 
But yeah, there's a lot of stuff that I definitely want to get my hands on. So yeah, this is my 2020 cop so far. Um, next video probably my probably my Jordan One collection, and after that probably my Yeezy collection. Yep. And um, yeah, probably my whole Jordan's collection. I don't know. Uh, I think of something. Oh, I do need a video about the Yeezy and the Jordan Eleven. All right, it's a point video. We're making it is I'm trying to make a point or something, but I doubt it happening this year. You guys will see when I make the video. But yeah, you guys, see y'all later. It's your boy DS Six One Four Seven. I'm out. Peace.